Sniffer dogs could soon be rolled out in public spaces across the country to help detect coronavirus. Oh, come on! Tim Yateman explains. Labradors like nine-year-old Fergus here are about to become health authorities' latest weapon in the fight against coronavirus. What? Oh, good grief. Better known for their work in drug and explosive detection, sniffer dogs are getting a new lease on life. Puppy power proving a winner in stopping the spread of COVID-19. <coughs> From airports to quarantine hotels and even shopping centres, canine detection units are about to become the new norm. We know that uh, they've been very good at detecting COVID in people that are positive, and we've got uh, some dogs that are up to 100% accurate. I'm French! Why do you think I have this outrageous accent? A team from the University of Adelaide has developed a training program that teaches dogs to sniff out compounds in sweat caused by the coronavirus. Huh? Even if a person doesn't know they're sick, the dog will pick up any trace of the virus. The hell is this, a joke? we will be able to see them in um, any location where people with COVID might come. Um, because the problem with COVID is that we've got a lot of people who are not showing any symptoms and they are transmitting the disease to other people. I fart in your general direction. Researchers have already been contacted by Victorian authorities as the state battles with its devastating second wave. It just can be another screening tool and a screening tool that is going to be repeatable very quick and very cost effective. <coughs> the first group of 10 dogs will begin their training in coming weeks. You can expect to see COVID sniffer dogs out on patrol in just two months' time. Scooby-Doo! That's all, folks.